I'm Johnny, and it's time for Brains. Boltzmann Brains. So you may be aware of this thing called the simulation hypothesis, which can be clinically described as basically the matrix. Bro, do you even philosophy? But you may not be aware of this thing called a Boltzmann brain. Now, a Boltzmann brain is a hypothetical self-aware entity, which because of quantum mechanics and the fact that the universe is full of random little quantum fluctuations, there exists a very remote possibility that more than just a single particle can pop into or out of existence. And what can actually pop into existence might be a teacup or a bunny rabbit or a brain, which sounds completely insane until you really stop and think about it, that the universe is very big and eternity is very long. So there's a lot of room for that to happen. Okay, so if you consider the current situation, which is to say that there's a whole bunch of self-aware entities, us, and we're in an organized environment, the world, what are the chances of that happening versus the chances that some standalone self-aware entities all of a sudden exist in a featureless thermodynamic soup of the end of the universe? Probabilistically speaking, the thermodynamic soup full of brains is vastly more probable than the existence that we take for granted. Now, I'm not going to try and tell you that that's what's going on. That would be crazy. <laughs>